Ladies, this video is for y'all. Guys, this video is for y'all. Ladies, just like y'all don't want to date no broke nigga, don't no man want to date no broke bitch. Ladies, the worst thing you can do is start talking to a guy and throw all your problems on him. And all the ones that be dry begging be the same ones that say these exact words. I hate asking anybody for anything. I would never ask nobody for anything. Oh my God, I can't believe I would ask somebody for anything. Y'all, what's coming next is her going to ask for something because she have nothing. And it be the prettiest, baddest bitches. But I'm about to share a story with y'all ladies and to y'all guys what not to do if you a female and if you a male what not to deal with. Why would you want to take on problems if you done got your life problem free or you only got a few problems or you got a lot of problems? Where's more problems coming your way, helping you, benefit you in any way? So let me go ahead and break this shit down. So it's a badass bitch. The bitch look like she can be an NBA player, NFL player, a rapper, look like a celebrity wife. A lot of you not. I'm going to go word from word. Hey, good morning, baby. Good morning. Hey, how you doing? How did you sleep, baby? I slept great. How about you? I tossed and turned last night. I got a lot on my mind. Bet. Do you want to know what I got on my mind? I'm busy, but... Of course, share with me what's on your mind. Your mind is a part of you, so share with me. Okay, when I get off work, I got to try to put a spare on and shit and get everything together myself. I said, oh, okay, what's your car on the side of the road or at work or what? It's on the side of the road, been there for a few days. I'm probably not going to be able to get a tire to Thursday. Okay, well, they make spare tires. Well, I don't have a spare tire, and they're going to cost more for the spare, and I don't have a jack. Well, I hate it for you. Yes, me too. And I just can't wait because I've been sitting waiting on a ride all day. I hate being without a car. And how old are you? I said anybody that's grown would hate being without a car. And I told her my age. She said, babe, I thought you was older than that. That's not old at all. I said my back and my knees hurt once I reach the age 30. Now nah, I'm just playing. I'm perfectly fine. But appreciate you though. She said, oh, wow. I wouldn't have thought you was up in your 30s or 30s. You look younger. I said, thanks. She said, this is what turned me off y'all the most. This text right here. I want to highlight this text for y'all. I want to highlight this. Y'all, my uh, screen protector fucked up. I want you to read that. Y'all read that. That's what fucked her up. This girl said, I'm going to call you when I'm walking home. I don't want to just be walking and not on the phone with anyone. So you a pretty broke bitch that can't afford Uber, can't afford a ride. You have two kids, two baby daddies. Need the baby daddy to pick you up from work? You have a mom. You say you stay with your parents. They won't pick you up. Hmm. So I said for Global Dripping Channel, let me do a little test. This is what a test came in at. I said, how far do you stay away from your job? She said, about 25 miles. I said, why would you walk 25 miles? How crazy the world is this day. How beautiful you are. And how good of a mother you say you are. And how good your pussy and head is. You ain't got nobody there to give you a ride. She said, Nah, this little old, wherever she from, I'm not going to call out where she from. They don't have Uber. And I'm fine, baby. Trust me, I'll be good. And that's what I'm doing now, trying to find a ride. 
but I can't pay nobody. The little money I got is for my tire. Now, now, I have three calls. One of them, I think at my mom's or at my homeboy house, I done forgot. I think at my, yeah, my homeboy said, he told me, come get your car. I'm tired of your car sitting out in my yard. Y'all, you can get a used tire for $25. You could get a towel for old car. If I'm up here in life and she all the way down there, she can't do nothing but bring me down. She didn't help me get up. Why would I bring her up? The best thing she could have done was kept all her problems to herself. So, for y'all purposes, I asked her. I swear to God, y'all know I'm stoic. Y'all see that? I swear to God, I asked this girl. I said, look, why I send you the cash? How much you need to get the tire and not to work from work? I just wanted to see. I just wanted to see was she's a gold digger that's trying to run game or she really a broke bitch. And I was hoping that she was a gold digger trying to run game because I was going to put her on game on how to really run game. And I was going to send her something and tell her how to run game. You too pretty to be broke. What the fuck? The fuck? Huh? Man, the girl said, baby, that's sweet, but I can't take no cash out from you. I just met you. I said, no problem. Would a hundred do? She said, that'll take care of my problems. I haven't had a hundred dollars in years, but I just can't have you send me nothing because I haven't done anything for you. I said, you don't owe me nothing. God told me to bless you. She said, I would not send you my cash out. So she's not a gold digger. She's just a broke bitch. So why are you trying to date if you're a broke bitch? Listen. All you guys, tell the next girl that you're pursuing that you got to walk 25 miles from home to work and you have no car and you stay with your parents, but you got the best dick in the world and you got two kids. And watch how fast this girl run and no contact you and ghost your dumb ass. Guys, start doing these girls the way they do us. Now, a lot of you not. Guys, I done upgraded in life. I have upgraded in life. The girls I've been fucking with been them explore Instagram motherfucking badass chick bitches. And y'all, they pulling up in 2000s, 2005 old ass Ford Fusions old ass Honda Civics, Honda Accords, and you be like, how the fuck can you pose in front of a Ferrari with a rapper and he seen you home with that beat up ass car that you been had? Y'all, it be the ones that got the most followers. It be the ones that got the most clout, showing the most ass. Getting the most likes be the brokest bitches. I just went to this girl page. I checked out her page. It showed that she was in Barbados two weeks ago. Bitch, you should have saved that Barbados money. That vacation lasted a day or two. That car need to get you back and forth to work. Where is your priorities at? And you're so dumb. You won't even let a nigga bless you with a honey. And bitch, I won't even gonna send the honey anyway. But she didn't know that. But I had to make this video, y'all. My life is full of women. And all I do is make content and I get paid big off of them. I'm talking about big off of them. And y'all like, y'all comment, y'all subscribe right now. Hit that bell notification. 
Because I got some baddies that finna join me on this channel. If y'all think the baddies that I done had on this channel and on my shorts bad, now wait. And my birthday coming up March the 12th. Y'all, I'm going to post up the sickest picture with my cash out. Y'all can bless a rich nigga or not. All y'all can do is make me richer. But God dang, I'm telling you, my birthday, y'all, I'm going to have every fucking different flavor. I'm going to show it to y'all. I'm going to have every flavor of women, every flavor of weed. I'm going to show out. I'm going to post nothing but shorts my birthday. Around March the 10th, I'm going to make about three or four videos, and I'm going to schedule them out to drop March the 10th, March the 11th, March the 12th. But them going to be old recordings because all I'm going to be doing is getting shorts because I'm going to have so many bad bitches around me. Oh, my God. Ooh, it's going to be dumb. It's going to be stupid. And... I'm going to tell y'all this. I got another secret for you guys at the end of this video. If you watch all the way to the end and you the GOAT, because I'm going to tell y'all a secret. Y'all doing my videos, I get y'all hitting gems without making a whole nother video. Guys, don't take yourself too serious. Ladies, don't take yourself too serious. Every adult that's dating want to be a big ass kid. They want to be goofy. They want to laugh. They want to have fun. If you can make a girl laugh and smile, you got her. You guys are taking yourself so serious and so thugged out. Man, that shit for the birds. But ladies, the whole point is, stop making people think that you are literally broke as fuck. And... If y'all could just see, y'all heard my phone say ding, ding, ding. If y'all could just see what these girls be saying to me, these girls be dying pieces. They be dying pieces. Like, I don't get it, you guys. Like, listen to this. If a girl in her late 20s or 30s or 40s and she's beautiful and ain't nobody wiped her up yet, or she done been wiped up and done been through several divorces, then the bitch has to be unbearable. Whether she crazy, the pussy sting, she jealous. You mean to tell me this girl done lived for 30 some years and ain't one man wiped her up? And if y'all hear that noise, that's my landscapers outside. Y'all hear all that noise. But with that said, I got to pay the motherfuckers anyway. But anyway, it's big business over here. Y'all like, Comment, subscribe. Let me know if y'all saw two videos in one. Cause I just gave y'all a gem. I could have made a whole new video off of that. But with that said, you guys, listen to me. Pinned up in the comment section is my Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. It's all the same hashtag at the Real Tab Flames. Go to my Instagram for show sure and my TikTok for sure. Facebook don't give a fuck about. Follow me. Like all my shit, show me love. Let me know you came from YouTube. I return the love. Also, if you want to book a $100 face-to-face -face time call, you get my personal number, can hit me up anytime. But the talk, I don't talk for cheap. $100 FaceTime call, plenty of people done left off satisfied, and it's anonymous. I don't call you out, screenshot it, I don't tell your business. I may make a video about it, but I ain't gonna say nothing about you. So y'all help me with my content with y'all problems. So no matter how big or small the problem is, I help you out. Also, I got merch y'all can buy, y'all see. And that's basically about it, man. You can check out my other channel, Money Harders, if you want to get some get some money. It's Money Harders. Put in Global Dripping, Money Harders. I harder up a lot of money, like a mess of money, like Money Harder. Also, Tab Flames, T-A-B slash F-L-A-M-E-Z. Y'all can type that in. You'll see all my music videos. Support everything I got going. Go to my socials. Click on my bio. Click on the links. Support everything I got going. I write kids, books, everything, man. I am the number one hustler. You'll never find a hustler um, more better than me. What's crazy about it, people tell me on this channel, are you the guy for money orders that make people all the money? Yes. Are you the guy that help everybody with the daily advice? Yes. Are you the rapper Tab Flames 
that got all the views. Yes, I am him. Look, I am him. It's tat. Let me pull up. I am him. That's why I got it tatted there. I am him. When girls say, you act like you don't love me. Stow it. They say, are you that guy that do, are you that guy, did you, all of that. You that got it. Is you that got it. Ah, is you that got it. Ah. Yeah, all, I am him. I am him. If you say he broke, then I am not him. That's the only thing. I holler, gang.